when you're you're a kid and you lose your mom, you're an orphan. When your husband dies, you're a widow. But when you when you lose a daughter, what are you? Orphan mom? That's how she feels. Well, that day that uh, we didn't even know until somebody called her, her friend, and said that um, there was a terrorist attack in Paris. I called Tim, and I asked him if, uh, if he can get a hold of Mimi just to find out if she's okay. So then he came, and he, he, just, he just went like this. And I, I go, well, what's going on? He looked at me, started crying. So then I go, calm down, because I don't understand what you're telling me. Tim went to the back, so then when she finished, I told Betty, come here, I gotta tell you something. She goes, what's going on? And Tim goes, oh, Mimi didn't make it. And she started like screaming, yelling, and she said, no, Mimi, no. And she threw herself on the floor. I grabbed her and Tim said, what do I do? I go, just hold her. I felt this big, hole in my heart <laughs> that I don't know how to fill it up. <laughs> like I lost half of my life <laughs> and like I lost direction. <laughs> I don't know what, I don't want to be like that. <laughs> I want it to be happy again. <laughs> Before I felt like I always, I always know where I was going, and now I like, what am I doing this for? I don't want to get lost. I choose to, you know, to pray and be happy. That's that's why I wanted to to um, get counseling and try to become a, even a better person for her.